Hello friends, in this video, we will learn about positive practices which you can inculcate in your daily life and encourage your friends for the same. First, let's know what positive practices really are. These are the practices which increase positive emotions, reduce negative emotions, increase positive coping, improve understanding about self and help in building life skills. These practices are easy to learn. Any one or more practices can be picked up and practiced in day-to-day -day life. These practices can be modified according to one's need and can be practiced more than once or as many times as individual feels comfortable. These practices does not require any help from professionals. Few of the positive practices which you can practice are humor, positive attribution, goal-orientedness, self-awareness and positive psychology principles. Now let's discuss how you can improve earlier mentioned positive practices in brief. Access your level of humor by comparing yourself with the people around you who according to you have high sense of humor. Try to include this humor in your day-to-day -day conversations. Observe the effect in your emotions. To know more about humor, you can visit the mentioned resources. Positive attribution How we explain negative events to our own self decides what our attribution style is, which could be positive versus negative. Here, we will understand our attribution style and if it's negative, then we will try to practice a more positive attribution style. Positive attribution brings positivity in our attitude and increases positive emotions in us. Now let's see how you can practice positive attribution style. Introspect and observe your own explanation for the event especially in situation when we face failures, loss or unexpected but bad outcomes. Sit calmly at one place and try to remember some negative events and see how you have explained these events to your own self. If some of the explanation given by you were negative, then try to find more positive explanations of same events to your own self. Take a pen and paper and try to remember some of your negative events and write how you have explained these events to your own self. If some of the explanations given by you were negative, then try to find more positive explanation of the same events and write it for your own self. More positive explanations of the same events and write it for your own self. Try to talk to positive people around you and ask them how they could have attributed in the similar situation. Try to model it next time. Change this in at least one situation, past or present, and notice change in your emotional level. To know more about attribution style, you can visit the mentioned resources. Keep at least one goal to increase your personal well-being. Think of all your goals. Write down one goal which you think may be contributing in your personal well-being or create one if you don't have one at present. Decide minimum time which you can give to achieve that goal. Maintain a schedule chart and tick on the schedule on daily basis. Practice it on daily basis for at least a week. Write down your emotions after completion of one week. Practice positive attribution to complement yourself. To know more about goal-orientedness, you can visit the mentioned resources. Knowing about oneself can be one of the best start to connect one's own self. Knowing about one's self can be one of the best start to connect to one's own self. There are many ways for becoming more aware about one's own self. Some recommended ways are maintaining a journal for everyday activities, 
self reflection and self monitoring taking feedback from right people around you taking self assessment from professional counselors to know more about self awareness and how you can be more self aware please visit the mentioned resources some examples of positive psychology practices are expressing gratitude journal writing happiness exercises positive self affirmations enhancing self esteem acknowledging self qualities developing self love mindfulness for detachment from negative talks you can add more practices in the list which you have experienced and feel are effective for promoting positive practices and positive development kindly make a list of practices which you feel are effective and post the list in the forum choose any one practice from the given list and practice it for 7 days write your experiences about the activity request at least 5 students of nearby vicinity to choose any one positive practice and ask them to try it follow up with those students note down those students feedback to know more about positive practices kindly visit the mentioned resources thank you friends for being with us throughout the video we hope that you will inculcate these positive practices in your daily life and encourage others for the same